Okay, in this guitar instruction video, we're going to go over some cool movable licks. Uh, of course, you can play them anywhere, but I just happen to be starting on the third string, first fret, with my second finger, sliding up to the second fret, barring the first two strings. So in this particular case, borrow the first two strings on the first fret with your first finger, after you slide on the third string from the first to second frets, and then just put the third finger down on the second string, third fret. And if you want to pick it, I'm just down, down, up, down, 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 up, down. And then I'm just moving it up. So now I'm on the second fret, I'm moving from the second fret to the third fret. Barring the second fret, both strings with my first finger, using the same fingering. I'm doing the exact same thing from the third to the fourth fret, and the, you know, starting on that third string. Moving right up. So that looks pretty much like that. It's pretty simple to follow. Then the next movable lick. You're also going to be barring two strings. Okay. Use your third finger on the third string, seventh fret, full step bend, and use a down, down, up pick. So if you're safer in the key of A, we're just playing it. So it's a basic, you know, 50s lick that you can apply. So full step bend on the third string, seventh fret. Third string, right? And then we're gonna borrow the second and first strings. I'm playing it down, down, up, moving that shape right up. So the seventh fret on the third string, fifth fret, both strings with the first finger. Now I'm on the eighth fret of the third string, third finger, first finger's on the sixth fret. So you just move it right up with that down, down, up, down, down, up. Now you can take these same two shapes and you can put them together. So say if I use a... Uh, well, I'm going to say that I'm on the um, third string, fifth fret with my second finger, sliding up to the sixth fret, using that first movable lick, and then so you can combine them. So wherever you start, I'm starting this time, okay, on the fifth fret, third string, with my second finger sliding up to the sixth fret. Making that mini bar with my first finger on the fifth fret of the second and first strings. Third finger is going to wind up on the seventh fret. And then, on the third string once again, you're going to bend the seventh fret with your third finger. And then you're just going to move it up. So, so I started on the fifth fret. Now I'm on the sixth to seventh fret. So you can combine those two licks, those two movable licks together. Last one I want to go over you with is, so... You're on the fifth fret. Instead of barring, just put your third finger on the second string, fifth fret, and your fourth finger on the uh, first string of the fifth fret. And you're going to play down, uh, a down pick, up pick, and down. So second string, first string, second string. Lift up your third finger, put your second finger on the fourth 
fret of the second string, keep your pinky there. You keep your fourth finger on the fifth fret of the first string. That's movable as well. So, pluck in the second string, the first, the first string, then the second string. Lifting up my third finger, putting my second finger on the fourth fret of the second string. Keep your pinky right there, right there on that fifth fret, first string. And plucking the second, first, and second strings. Then putting your first finger on the third fret of the second string. Second, first, second strings, and then just... You can actually play both strings together. So you wind up like that. Here we go. Now I'm moving up to the sixth fret. Seventh fret. Okay, so you got all three of those movable licks. We're gonna play it. And then So if I'm if I start on the sixth fret of the third string, sixth of the seventh, just play it the way I explained it. Sixth of the seventh fret. And you're on the 6th fret again, 8th fret, and then you're barring, or actually you're bending on the 3rd string, the 8th fret. Now you're back on the 6th fret, this way, and you play. And no matter where you are, you can move this stuff up. There you go. Hope you enjoyed this video on uh, some cool movable licks. If you did, please like and subscribe. Keep playing and have fun.